People recall when they would go to the lakes and spend time there, but all they now see are bad, smelly and sewage-filled lakes. In a study carried out by IISC in January 2016, 98% of the lakes have been encroached and 90% have been polluted. I think there was a park, I believe, around this thing some years back. And I think uh, it went down again. Then again, I think somebody again uh, cleared it up. Now again, I think it looks like uh, they get back uh, to burst. In the past 10 years, BBMP has tried to work for the betterment of the lakes all across Bangalore. But this is what they plan to do to solve the sewage inflow. So, as of now, we have made all arrangements. Uh, the sewage uh, not to enter the lake. We have made in all our developed lakes, the sewage has been diverted in next lakes. Okay. That is the arrangement. Mm. So only the storm water drain is uh, yeah. entering our lake, but little bit of uh, it is mixing with uh, the sewage and entering the lake. Mm. It takes some time. Dr. T. V. Ramachandra, who has worked and analysed all 193 lakes, has raised his concerns on this issue. BMP mm -hmm. rejuvenated 45 lakes in Bangalore. 87% of the lakes are in a very bad state. This is because they have not rejuvenated the lake as per the scientific protocol. Scientific protocol insists for decontamination of the lake and also arresting sewage and industrial effluent getting into the lake and stopping the encroachment. None of this has uh, happened in any of the lake rejuvenated and there a lot of money has spent on this. Because of this, most of the lakes have gone back to the... the in fact, some of the lakes have gone worse than the earlier. That is, because the way they disturb the silt, all that contaminants got released to the water. This miscommunication between the officials and the scientists could one day remove all lakes that we have in the city once and for all. But there is the responsibility of a citizen to stop this from happening. This is Shipra reporting for CityCast.